Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Good to see you here again. Um, I just wanted to show uh, another flipbook that I made. Um, I had some uh, leftover papers from the Doodle Bug Spring Things line. I made about three, I think, pocket letters with it. And uh, I had some left, so I thought Let's cut it up and make a flipbook. And I made this. Um, I cut the pages in. Uh, I used the height six, and then I think I made it four and a half wide. And um, I liked how that looked and I wanted to use this hello and that little birdie and th these are so cool these were in the odds and ends uh, package that I had and these are like semi-transparent I love these so cute okay but for the rest I just used the pages vertically instead of horizontally and I'll just um, put the camera down it's a little bit easier so I got four pages Zip. and uh, they're all double-sided I didn't glue anything together so if you open it oops actually I got five pages haha <laughs> if you open it up what you see first is this I made a pocket here just got a triangle out of paper and in it I put a little shaker mason jar made this with my envelope punch board and it's so freaking cute glitter I used yellow and pink you hardly see the yellow but that's okay and some yellow and pink and green sequins in there looks kind of cool I thought so I put that in here and on this page I did another pocket and I made this I don't even know how you call them library card holder or something and I added some fun papers in here and that was that and then if you open it up I just kind of used most of the die cuts that I had um, yeah this page I had a doodle bug doily in limeade and I cut it in half and I put this cute little snail on there and butterfly kisses and a little sticker of a flower and then here is a little caterpillar isn't it cute and the text so happy together and in the middle I love these pre-cut banner flags that they put in the odds and ends and uh, I just picked some colors and divided this word spring over the two middle pages and I used some do uh, no not doodle box stickers um, these I got at the dollar store so I thought they were kind of cute and I just had some leftover paper here and I made a little other page you are awesome no you're you're sweet it says and a little heart and here hello spring and I mean this little ladybug isn't just too cute for words I think so and here and the grasshopper so cute I love it I love this stuff and uh, well here is that pocket and here oh you go in there and I might wrap it together with a piece of twine I'm not sure yet so this is how you close it up you go a bit there and I cut some of the middle pages off otherwise it would be too chunky so now at least you're able to close it and I left the bag as is because 
there's so many things going on here. And I think that I'm going to send this to a very dear friend of mine. Uh, I'm not going to say who, but I love her to pieces. She's very supportive. And uh, I think she deserves some. Just because mail from me or like a rag random act of kindness right so that was this and uh, I actually don't know what I'm gonna do next uh, I'll probably find some spring uh, summer paper and start out a summer pocket letter or something like that tomorrow I'm gonna buy a new computer yes I'm so happy because that buzzing noise that you hear is my old one and that sounds like it's about to take off to the moon and every day I keep my fingers crossed that it still works and finally tomorrow I'm getting a new one and I'm so excited so if you don't see me for a couple of days you know that I'm trying to get the hang of Windows 10 because this old baby is running on Windows Vista well that's old right so I hope you all have a wonderful Easter weekend I'm sure you do the weather here is nice and I'm not sure what it's going to be Sunday, but, but we'll see. Probably rain. It's Canada, right? Spring is so surprising, has everything. Um, thanks for stopping by, and have a wonderful day. Bye.